Uh, Wayne, a 3 0 final score. Do you feel this was a harsh scoreline in the end? You know what? I actually do. I think it was a little bit harsh. I felt, you know, they were, they were the better team than us in the end and deserved to win. Um, but I think, you know, 3 0 was a little bit harsh on my players. But, you know, I can't, I can't fault my players. They worked incredibly hard. We just lacked a little bit of uh, cutting edge in the, in the second half. It didn't really threaten them, which was, that was the only disappointing thing for me. And do you feel in the, in the first half we made a good account of ourselves with a couple of chances and cleared off the line I, as well? I, I felt that for 30 minutes up until they scored, well, I think we were probably slightly the better team and you know probably created the better chances. Um, they get the goal and it gives them creates a little bit of momentum for them. And you know. When you're playing against a team that have got very, very good footballers throughout their team, it's going to be difficult. We knew that, and we we felt that a half an hour just before they scored, the crowd were kind of, you know, getting on them a little bit, and we felt if we could have just held out, but it wasn't meant to be. And you know, they came out in the second half and, and changed their system slightly, and, and we found it difficult to get out of our half at times. Do you feel the team could have come back a bit better after conceding the first goal, especially coming out in the second half? I, I think we tried, you know, I think they, they, they stopped us from playing in the second half, they changed their system and formation a little bit, and it made it difficult for us, but uh, I, I can't, I can't, I've got no problems with my players, you know, their work rate and effort, uh, like I say, I just was disappointed a little bit with, uh, that we didn't threaten them more in the second half, you know, so, there you go. Uh, I don't know, we're going to have to look at it tomorrow, I think he got a bit of a whack on his calf, so uh, he had to come off because I think he, he was uh, feeling it a little bit, we'll have to assess that tomorrow. And we knew it wasn't going to be an easy fixture, but do you feel the team did give it their best shot? Of course they did, they always give me everything they have and I can't I can't complain about that. Um, you know, we're playing against a team that got relegated from the Championship last year and you know, for 30 minutes gave a very, very good account of ourselves. I'm disappointed, like I say, we didn't threaten in the second half and, you know, as much as I'd like, but you know, when they've got a goal up, and I don't care what team you are, who you are, you know, you, 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 you get a goal in front and it changes the complexion of the game and it did today. And, you know, but they've got some good players and we knew that. And you made the double substitution with over Femi and Chris Dixon coming on. Do you think that they made a good impact? They, they tried, you know, I don't think we, as I said, I don't think we threatened too much at all in the, in the, in the uh, second half and you know we tried to change it and you know we, we you might as well get beat three or four uh, and we did so uh, but you know we're pushing forward we're trying to we're trying to trying to get a goal and, and you know you're going to leave gaps at times so you know. the first goal is a deflected goal from Gavin Hoyt um, do you feel that it's hard to get back from that especially when it's your own player that's deflected it and cost the goal yeah I think their goal was a bit fortunate unlucky on our side but um I think we needed to close down the shot a bit quicker, but I thought, like I said, we started the game off quite well. Reason we were 20 25 minutes, had a couple of chances, but um, to go in one or down half times is disappointing. And do you think um, we were unfortunate not to score? We had our fair share of chances before they scored their first goal? Yeah, we had a couple. We had one. Um, Harry had one, which maybe they should have done a bit better with, but um, winning 1 0 half time, said to the boys, if we just keep it one, then the crowd would get frustrated. Um, but we didn't manage to do that. And were you pleased with the team's effort overall? Um, yeah, I think we like we always give 110 percent. But I think maybe um, we didn't have, we didn't have, we didn't keep the ball for long enough periods and we were chasing. So when we did get the ball, it was a bit tired, so we gave it back straight away. But um, there's another game on Tuesday, which we look forward to. So hopefully, we'll put it right then. Uh, do you feel that uh, maybe you could have done better, or were you pleased with your performance? Um, I think I could have done better off the ball. I thought I worked hard, um, but yeah, I think maybe but when I did get the ball, I was a bit tired. So. Um, well, he wasn't there, but I thought I worked hard off the ball, but I thought I could do better every game. And how disappointing is it to be knocked out of the cup? Yeah, very disappointing. And, um, we're looking, hopefully, to go on a little run in the FA Cup, but um, now that's over, we have to concentrate on the league and St Johnson Bank. And how are the boys going to pick themselves up from this defeat going into the game on Tuesday? Um, we're, we're buzzing at this game on Tuesday, so we have to wait another whole week for another game. So, um, yeah, we know we made mistakes. We have to learn from them and take into the game on Tuesday. And... Um, do you think it was a good test playing against another League One side going into the game against Peterborough on yeah, Tuesday? Yeah, it was a good test. Obviously, we played a, a team from the League above, so it's good to see how far we've come. Um, disappointing result, but we can take a couple of positives into Tuesday's game.